a great little starfish. It's an astrina. I have plenty of them in the tank. They're all over the place. They are, in this case, algae eaters. There are many different species of this little starfish. Um, I've read that there are hundreds of different species and that the vast majority of those species are harmless algae eaters. People see them in the tank and they've heard that they are coral eaters and they panic and they want to know how to get rid of them. Some of them are and if you're one of the few unlucky people to get those they do need to come out of your tank. The best way to figure out what you have is where you see them in the tank. If they're on the glass, eating algae, then it's a good bet that they're algae eaters. If you see them on your zoanthus, or at the base of your SPS, then it's a good bet that they're coral eaters. So, if you have them in your tank, you see them on the rocks, you see them on the algae, um, you see them on the glass, don't worry about it. Uh, enjoy them. They'll proliferate in your tank. You can see this little guy. He just has two full-size legs and then three partial legs. And this guy just has four. This guy has five. This guy is broken apart. Um, this guy is a perfect specimen and quite large for them. This is about as big as they, they get. And you can see that's not very big. Um, so the way they propagate is by dropping off legs. Those legs become new sea stars. And so you'll often see them in your tank with missing appendages. And generally the reason is they have dropped an appendage um, or have been themselves a dropped appendage and are growing into a new one. So anyway, just something fun. I enjoy them. I like to have them in my tank. I remember years ago, the very first one I had, I was actually quite excited about it because it was a little freebie to me is you know hitchhikers like that that you, you get you don't pay for it's a sea star that lives in my tank and I don't have to pay for it I don't need, need to do anything about it because it takes care of itself just by eating algae so it's beneficial it's fun it's free what's the problem with that so just keep an eye on them when you have them if they're on your corals okay then then you have a problem other than that don't panic just enjoy um, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.